Welcome to the channel everybody. We're gonna do a video just kind of a Update on how things are going. So today is my trash day uh, Thursday is our <coughs> Longest hardest route that we have so far So I did a video December 26 of 2022 that was My first the idea of coming up with the trash business Took me a few months, I would say six months for paperwork, getting the truck and all this other stuff gathered up, the uh, permits from the government and all that stuff. Um, so anyways, we're, we're about six to eight months. I think my first customer, which is also on the channel, was like June or something like that. Um, so anyways, we have 300 cans out now. Um, and 110 of those are on Thursday, and Thursday is the worst route because that is spread out over one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like seven cities, we'll call them towns or whatever, seven different areas. Very, very spread apart, um, but we'll fix that later on. We can handle it so far. Eventually, we'll have to... Uh, split people on those routes so nine o'clock 9 a.m that's what time i show up to work um and my guy showed up at about 8 30 so we did not have the dumpster in the truck ready to go so i've got to go do that dumpster they are in the jeep and a utility trailer and they're hauling cans um so they're swapping out cans, my original thing, because we can't get all of them in this trailer. Oh, um, I've got my dumpster. That's full from Wednesday's route, and which all of Wednesday's route fits in this trailer. It's like 50 cans or something like that. Um, so I've got to go dump this for the guys and get it set up. I've got a video on how I do this. So this is our trailer. So this comes off. I put a hitch up front. And we tow this around to dump trash. It's got a platform on the side and a net. So also on the list, I have a mechanic shop. So here is the, the line of mechanic work. So this one needs injectors and a few other things. That one's turbos. We're doing a video on rebuilding the turbos on that. So oil change, oil change, oil change, oil change, oil change motor rebuild long-term project stuff that's got to be out today engine over there long-term project my personal truck um electrical work going into this is a duramax going into d-rate um didn't do a video on this this was head gaskets it needs uh we did an exhaust system for them that one's pretty much done but oil changes have to be out today um that is one of my dumpster trucks, we're going to throw it in line for an oil change. All my other junk that doesn't matter. Um, the little Acura is um, valve job and timing. Smack the valves. Van is oil change, suspension work. PCM, transmission, bunch of work. This came in last night for brakes or seized in the rear. Um, yeah, so I've got to go do this dumpster. My guys are out swapping cans. They've got their list. Oh, there's a Dodge on the rack inside for, um, which there's a guy clocked in. I don't understand. Anyways, there's a guy around here somewhere. So there's a Dodge on the lift for head gaskets. And so I'm going to start, start vehicles and I got to decide how much to help him and how much to help the trash guys. So we do trash, dumpsters, property cleanup, awnings, patio covers, little bit of landscaping stuff, mechanic shop, machine shop, do a little bit of everything. Um, and that's growing, growing all these businesses individually, seeing how it goes. Um, so nine o'clock, I'm getting started. Let's see how this goes. Probably going to try to beat my guys back real quick. I'm going to go do the dumpster and then try to help this guy in oil changes and whatever else is going on. We'll just line these oil changes up outside. We have six of them, so it's not worth going in and out of the shop for that. We'll crack all the drain plugs, put drain pans under all six of them, and 
do them in a production type manner. All right, let me get started. So for yesterday's route, which we just dropped off the dumpster, 1.2 tons, or 1.02 tons, $46.69, so about 50 bucks a week for 55 cans. All right, I'm all loaded up. My guys are not back yet for their first run, so get started on oil changes. Took the dump trailer off, put the uh, hitch on, safety chains, magnetic lights, and our platform. So, I know what you're thinking. Yes, this is legal. It's got a license plate on it. We took it to the DMV, had an inspection. It's registered. This comes off. This does not stay on there. So anyways, pick up cans here, dump them over the side, slides back and forth, can go on the other side if, it, if needed. We have magnetic flashers on it. And tarp is in the back of the truck. That has not been fully uh, fully figured out yet, but other than that, we just harbor freight net. We bungee it down, roll it out of the way, yada, yada, yada. So he's going to get Van in. I'm going to go get these other six, five oil changes. I think there's five. And uh, line them all up, start knocking those things out. All right, so we got van draining, oil change. This one needs an inspection on the rest, brakes and everything. He's on the last one. So, forward. Got all those. Everything's draining underneath. So while he's doing those, we will uh, start writing tickets for all of them, do check engine inspect the rest and uh, see if I can upsell anything, see if there's any work that they need. Um, go from there. So I helped him with oil changes, finishing up on those. My guys finally got back. We got uh, 23 cans done with the Jeep. So it is lunchtime now. So that's our longest route, so that takes them forever to do those 20, 23, cause that pretty far away. Um, like I said, I didn't have the, which we, we usually do these with the Jeep anyways. Um, mainly cause the truck's kinda hard to get in and out of that neighborhood. It's like 25 miles away from here and the trailer doesn't hold all the cans that we do in one day anyways. So, um, it's cooling down, it's getting cold. So, I'm gonna start delivering oil change vehicles. All right, so, done with the oil changes, all those are gone. I gotta check the battery in this van. Charging system works. But, battery test, battery in place, so go get a battery for this customer, and then, um, so we've got my little shop truck loaded up, <coughs> neighborhood has four cans, I've got parts to return. To go pick up uh, <coughs> pick up checks to pay my guys tax accounting office I gotta go pick up the books I gotta go deposit money in the account deposit checks for the day um, and I'm gonna go grab something to eat guys are back from lunch they took the truck and trailer to go do 50 55 more and we'll only have four more to do after that, which is another neighborhood that the truck and trailer don't uh, fit in. 
Another thing I forgot to mention is we do eBay. So one of the trash guys wakes up and packages the eBay sales. So we only got two today. And uh, get those delivered to the post office while we're at it. So off delivering a van to this customer. He's got to travel in it tomorrow. So we did the oil change. And my guy did a motor mount while I was gone. Diagnosed the noise as a motor mount. Got it swapped out. So we are delivering it. Going and picking up five cans in his neighborhood. Because he's also off the beaten path. So we charge, or we, we saved five cans until I got this van delivered. And he's got to go out of town tomorrow. His house being one of the cans. So anyways... Already dark as hell. Uh, 4.52. Frickin' sucks. But, uh, yeah, that being dark this early in the summertime, we can do another hour or two of work and not even notice that it's getting late. So, wintertime's gonna kick our butts. Alright, on to the next. Phone is almost dead, but we are done, so... We have our 20 cans loaded up for the next run. Our six cans loaded up for a uh, route on Monday. Um, we have all of our cans emptied, ready to go. And then what else did we do? So we got the dually in here. Brakes are quoted out. Job is sold for that guy. So I'll do that tomorrow. My guys are going to do an awning tomorrow. Another business that I have. 5% um, on my battery. Crashing fast. So that's what my day looks like on a Thursday. Thursday is my worst day. Um, I know some of you are following along with this situation. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. We will see you on the next video. And um, I might do another little update sometime in December on my one year mark near near new year so other than that thanks for watching we'll see you the next time oh, fyi it's 5 52 so we're closing out at six o'clock so uh can't remember what time i started at nine so and then yeah got a lot done today not as much as i'd like to it gets dark early it got dark at like 4 30 on us so uh we are going home and do it again tomorrow.